Adventure. Here's romance. Here's O. Henry's famous Robin Hood of the Old West, the Cisco Kid. First is rent the cattle, then feed the cattle, then water the cattle, 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 cattle. Holy smokers, I hear cattle till it's running off from my ears. <laughs> Pancho, I thought you always liked cattle. I do like the cattle in a plate in front of them with plenty of salsa, the chili valley, frijoles, and tortillas. There you go again, thinking of nothing but your stomach. Yeah, well, why should I? What am I going to do without it? Say, Cisco, when are you going to get to this railhead? Tomorrow. Good morning, Sheriff. Whose cattle are these? They belong to Ben Farley of the Diamond D Ranch and Durango. Well, do you mind if my boys take a look at them? Not at all, sir. Go right ahead. All right, boys. What's this all about? Well, there's been quite a bit of rustling going on here lately. I'm just checking up on all the herds of my territory. Yeah, but this cattle didn't was rustling. Besides, we didn't get it anyhow. Ben Farley asked us to deliver the cattle at the railhead and pick up the money at the Tri-State Company in Fargo. Well? You're right, Sheriff. The brands have been changed. Get his gun, Blackie. I don't care what your deputy says, Sheriff. These cattle haven't been stolen. I've known Farley for years. He's not a cattle rustler. Well, I say he is, and so are the rest of you. You're under arrest. Why bother running him in, Sheriff? Let's just spring him up now and save the county a lot of expense. Yeah, that's not a bad idea, Blackie. Get a couple of ropes. Always I am a big fool to listen to you. You also tonto como un burro. All right, all right. Stop that kind of talk. You've got to talk, talk English. Don't you like Spanish? Yeah, when it comes to the yell. But I don't like things I can't understand. Now, get over there. Over here. Prepare Pancho. No te pigas. Cuidado. I said cut it out. I was only telling Pancho. Thank you. 
Then we've lost them, Blackie. Where in the name of smoke did they get to? The boss ain't gonna like this, letting them two get away. Maybe they double back to the herd. Come on. This winch is gonna get back the cattle. Without guns, we wouldn't have a chance. Yeah, but the cattle. We'll get the cattle back. I think the best place to reason with that sheriff is in his own office. We'll first go to town and get a couple of guns. Then we'll pay him a visit. Come on, Pancho. I wouldn't try that, mister. Pancho, get his gun. We're not going to harm you. We're only looking for the sheriff. What do you want of him, Cisco? You know me, huh? I've seen pictures of you around here and there. Who you see my picture too? I'm Pancho. You haven't answered my question. This sheriff is a no good crook. He steal a whole herd of cattle from us. What? That's the truth. If you don't bring this cattle back, Pancho is going to kill him until he dies. Now look here, I won't have you calling me a rustler. I didn't steal your cattle. Don't get excited, mister. We said it was the sheriff, not you. I'm the sheriff. Well, you? Yes, me. Now, will you tell me what this is all about? Yes, Cisco, what this is all about. Cisco, I'm all mixed up. The sheriff is a rustler, and instead of being a rustler, he's a sheriff. I'll be a gee whiz, I'm all mixed up. Cisco, what do you see over there with my eyes? Hey, he's the crooked sheriff. Sheriff, come out here, quick. What do you want? There is that man I was telling you about. How'd things go, Al? Well, we got the cattle, all right, but uh, Pancho and Cisco got away. You dunderhead. I tell you how to make an easy $20,000 and you mess it up. Ah, what are you beefing about? We got the cattle, that's all that matters. With Cisco and Poncho on the loose, anything can happen. Don't get excited, they're not bulletproof. I... Don't let your hand stray, mister. Poncho, take his gun. Now, would you mind telling me what this is all about? How you like those, Cisco? This morning you play make-believe sheriff, you take all our cattle, and now you say, what's this all about? I didn't take your cattle, you're barking up the wrong tree. I was in town all morning long, and I can prove it by Mr. Kelly here. <gasps> Cisco, how can you tell such a crooked lie with such a straight face? Now, Mr. Shelby's telling the truth, gentlemen. I, he, it couldn't have been him. You're sure of that, Sam? Of course. This is the second time I've been mistaken for that crook. He must look exactly like me. He does. And he talks like you, too. Even your clothes are the same. And so is your horse. That doesn't prove anything. If Mr. Kelly says this man was in town all morning, then he was. He's not in the habit of lying. Gentlemen, this is my fiance, Miss Lacey. Well, miss, if you say so, we must be mistaken. Come on, Pancho. You know, Sam, I think they still suspect me. So would I if Sam hadn't cleared you. This plain like my nose on your face. This hombre is a crooked sheriff. But when I put a good look at you, you don't know what time it is. <laughs> no, Pancho. I wanted them to think that we believed Shelby's story. Well, then you think like Pancho, that he is the same man, huh? Of course. Oh, then uh, why this fellow Kelly, why he, he the cattleman, why he make this cover up? He could have a very good reason. And you were going to deliver the herd to the railhead because we were supposed to collect the money from him. Then you think he is mixed up with his rustlers? I'm sure of it. Well, what are we waiting for? Why don't we go and make him talk? I... First, we'll see if we can locate the herd. How are you going to do that? Well, let Mr. Shelby show us the way.
the matter, Blackie? I just spotted Cisco and Pancho. We're heading around Walker's Point. Pete, get in your horse. Send them back to Durango in a coffin. We will return in just a moment with the climax of our exciting adventure of the Cisco Kid. Take care of them, Pancho. You've got to help me. He's after me. He's going to kill me. Kill you? By who? That's Cisco kid. I was riding along minding my own business when he started shooting at me. I, I, he's going to take me for that wrestler again. Well, hide in the kitchen. He just came in here. Where is he? But I tell you, he's not here. I suppose that horse out there is not his? That's far enough, Cisco. I'm not going to let you shoot an innocent man. Now drop your gun. Why are you doing this? Just because your cattle buyer friend is mixed up with the rutlers? You're very annoying, miss.
stupid numbskull. Can't you ever do anything right? Stop that name calling. I don't like it. They've got Blackie in jail, and I'm supposed to like that. Don't worry about Blackie. He won't blab. How do you know he won't? If it'll make you any happier, there's one way to make sure. You'll probably botch that up, too. Let me handle it. You just keep out of sight until I send for you. Mr. Appley, Sheriff? No, thank you. Hey, Cisco, I take care of you crooks like you told me. Nice work, Pancho. Has he done any talking yet, Sheriff? Complaining about the food, that's about all. Yeah, don't worry, Pancho will take good care of him. None of that, Pancho. Oh, Cisco, I won't hurt him, just a couple of little digs. I said none of that, Pancho. Oh, son, those monkeys have fun, but Pancho never. Hey, Blackie. No! He got away, but he left his calling card. Don't shoot, Pancho. We need him alive to lead us to our cattle. Get our horse. Charlie! Cisco and Pancho are after me. Get the rest of the men on guard. Must be their hideout. Come on, but be very careful. Drop that rifle. Well, Mr. Kelly, I brought you back part of your boot heel that you lost. They must have slipped into the shack. Come on, let's get him. Here, take care of yourself. I could have shot you right between the eyes. Here come the others, he's cold. Pacho, come here, tie him up.
move. Throw your guns away. Now get your hands up. Keep your eyes on them, Pancho. I got them, Cisco. Thanks for leading us to the cattle, Mr. Kelly. The sheriff will be waiting for you and your friend. It feels so wonderful. The cattle is shipped and the crook has been put in the jail and we keep the beautiful senorita from marrying up with the crook. Oh, see, I feel so wonderful. Cisco, wait! Uh-oh, the sheriff. Pancho, wait. <laughs> Not Pancho, that's what he told me the last time. I've been chasing you for more than 10 miles. What happened now? Nothing. The rustlers took your guns, didn't they? Yes. Well, here they are. Why, thanks, Sheriff. Keep your hands up, Sheriff. You can't do this to Cisco. Why, Pancho, the Sheriff was just returning our guns. <laughs> I knew it all the time. <laughs> oh, Pancho. Oh, Cisco. Let's win. <laughs> <laughs> The Cisco Kid will be back in a moment. But first, an important message. Goodbye, amigos. See you soon! <laughs>